what some of these South African slang words that I have mean. Yes. Um, this was quite difficult for me to do because uh, being South African and us obviously being married, as he knows quite a lot of those slang words already because I've taught him and I use a lot of the words anyways in my everyday language. Um, yeah. So this was a little bit difficult trying to find ones that he didn't understand or doesn't know, I should say really. Um, so I've put a list together, 10 slang words. Hopefully there's a few in there that you won't know so that you can sit there and try and figure it out. I doubt it. <laughs> but hopefully you'll be, well, we'll see. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so how it's gonna work, I've got um, 10 slang words written down on my phone. Um, we'll put them up on the screen so that you guys can also see. Um, Husky's gonna pronounce the word and then tell me what it means. And then if you don't know, you can then ask me to use it in a sentence to kind of help you figure out what it means. Yeah. Understood? Yay! Alright. Alright, let's do this. Let's go. So I've got them all here. Alright, the first one is... I think it says I Icona. Icona? I think it's probably say Icona. 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 So that obviously I think is, is probably like Zoom. Yep. Um, Icona, I'm trying to think. Uh, what do you think it means? All I think about is that song by Muffy Zola, bro. Corner, bro. Corner. <laughs> corner. No, that's um, not that. <laughs> I corner. I'm gonna say, I haven't actually heard this one. I'm trying to use. This no, one. I don't tend to use this one so, really. This might be like some OG one in it. Like, yeah, a little bit. A little bit, yeah. Um, I corner. So I'm this one. Say... Do you want me to use it in a sentence? Go on then. It's similar to another one that I use frequently. That's why I didn't use that one. So I this have a one is, is. I corner. How can you be doing that? Or I corner. I can't believe this person is going and doing that. Uh, or whatever. So what? That is kind of hard. <laughs> I'm gonna say does it mean like oh my god in a way? Yeah. Basically, it's like oh my god, what's going on? Yeah, basically. It's, it's like a, a, an expression of like disbelief. Ah, cool. Alright, so one point. Yeah, that was good. That was quite good. Cool, I'm gonna switch to the next one now. Back the other way. This Back, one? No, that other way. Oh, sorry. <laughs> okay, this is uh, dot C. Dot C? Dot C, so. Dot C? T S O T S I. Uh, I actually know Pronounce that. Pronounce it again. Dot C. 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 So, si, si, so, si, so, si, so, si, so, si. I'm saying the same thing. Right. <laughs> Maybe we need to do a, a, a husband the Zulu challenge, yeah? <laughs> uh, actually, you know what this one knows? I actually also know it as well because I saw the movie. Yes, there's a movie um, that's called this as well. It was actually quite, it was a while back actually, it was a really good movie. And I believe it means like a uh, gangster, if I'm correct. Yes. Like so, and mafios or gangster. Yeah. So it's mainly like yeah. So just a gangster. So if like it can mean to anyone from like a street mugger to like a street gang person. Yeah. Um. So yeah. So this one oh, is God. one that I know. Um. Yeah. Also, it's what thirty five degrees today. Yeah. And it's really hot in here. We've got the aircon on, but really yeah. struggling to feel it right. Cool. Now. <laughs> All right. Number three. Uh. Oh, I think I know what this one is, is it? Go <laughs> pronounce it. Or I think it's pronounced uh, Vutsek. Yeah, very good. Uh, V-O-E-T-S-E-K. Um, this one I believe is Afrikaans, if I'm correct. It is, yes. And I believe, I randomly said it one time for no reason. I don't know why, I just like, what? How can you say that? But I don't know what they used it in a sentence. Uh, how can I say? Ugh, Nir. Vutsek! Yeah, okay, yeah, you could say that. So basically, it just means like, fuck off, I think. Yes, like piss uh, off. Piss off, yeah. Just be, yeah. So, uh, so that one actually, I, I remember. I foot set, Gwena. 
basically she's at, like remixed everything there. Uh, so yeah, this one actually like I, I as I said I randomly used it one time. Charlie was like, oh, do you know what that means? I was like, uh, no, because it's in my head. All right, cool. Um, oh wow. Okay, this one is. If I pronounce it English style, is pronounce it how you think it's like shame. <laughs> But if I pronounce it the way it should be pronounced, it might be pronounced Aksha Me. Uh, I don't really know, I just made a remix. It probably is not, is it? You got the first way you pronounce it was closer, so it's Ach Shame. Ach Shame, oh, it's the Afrikaans one. <laughs> so the Ach bit is, um, Shame is obviously just the English word. Uh, the, the Ach is just like a, a word that you would actually know. You, you say, it. what do you think yeah. it means? <laughs> uh, it might mean like, Oh, uh, how unfortunate. Like, for example, her daughter died, ah, shame, or her daughter got arrested for yeah, smoking flowers, ah, shame. Kind of. It's more of. So, this is what, um, this is what I realized when I came to the UK, and I would say, ah, oh, shame. So, sometimes, sometimes you might just say, ah, oh, shame, and not say, ah, shame. So, it depends on, it depends on the context. Um, and I would say, ah, oh, shame, when someone is, is saying, like, oh, she's really pretty. And I'd be like, ah, oh, shame. So in, in, <laughs> in South Africa, saying, ah, shame is actually a term of endearment. Okay. Rather than it being seen as, like, a negative, so, like, oh, poor baby. It's not really like that. You'd say it like, oh, she's really cute. You'd be like, ah, oh, shame. Yeah, she is. Okay, so that's another <laughs> mad one. Uh, okay, so I, I didn't get that one actually, to be fair. I said how unfortunate, because I looked at the word shame. Yeah, shame, yeah, that's, that, that's so, why I added in there, and you get like, that one a bit. Alright, next one. <laughs> this one is fucker. <laughs> yes, it's, it's spelled like that, but it's not pronounced like that, so it's fucker. Fucker. Okay, it's basically F A K A is going to be written down there, right? So. Okay, I think I just said it in an English way. Fuck up. <laughs> but it's not the other one. It says F A K A. So Faga. 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 So, so say it's like a G rather than a K. Okay, Faga. Okay. Uh, I'm trying to think what that could mean. Uh, use it as a sentence. Um. So bring me, bring me the remote and Fagala. She went. Mad. <laughs> bring me the remote and Fagala, please. Oh, does that mean like bring me my slippers? Faga, is that slippers or something? No, so pass me the remote and fagala. Oh, pass me the remote and sit down. <laughs> faga means sit in it. No. <laughs> what? <laughs> pass me the remote and. I'm probably not saying it right to be honest. Okay, okay like. You do another one. <laughs> okay, let me see. Uh, what else can I say? Um. <laughs> Take the camera. Okay. And fagala. Oh, faga means there. Like put it there. Yes. I got it. There. Finally, I was like, what? <laughs> Sorry, the first one I probably because yeah, you, you passed me the remote. Why would I then tell you to put it there? But yeah, so. Yeah. So okay, cool. That one was. So la is like there, and uh, faga is like put. So to put. So okay. it's like to put there. Cool. Okay, so it's not faka. It's faka. <laughs> faka. <laughs> All right. Cool. Next one. Oh, I think I might know this one. This is actually koki. Yeah, you so pronounced it right. It's basically like C O K I E. So uh, koki, I think, is actually um, what's that thing? Uh, that basically crayons, I think, or like felt tips, if I'm correct. Yes, felt tips. That's it. Felt tips. Yeah. So that's what like Charlie calls. Yeah, Cookies so pass like... me the cookie so I can draw. Oh, what? <laughs> what cookie is that? Like, some drugs. <laughs> so, yeah, yeah, so cookie is a, a felt tip pen. So felt tip that you draw on. Um, mm. Draw with, sorry. Cool. Uh, next one is. I think this one might be Afrikaans again. Yes. Because it has that Dutch, you know, vibe. It's called uh, Dof. Um, or is it Doof? No, Dof. You're right. Dof. Dof. Uh, it sounds like some guy's name that creates a thing. <laughs> like Heinz Doff. <laughs> Doff, I'm gonna say means. Actually, wait, use it in a sentence, I don't know. Ah, why are you so doff? Ah, why are you so doff? 
Was that good? That was terrible. I think it means dumb. Yes. Or like stupid. Yes. Uh, also, the way it's written as well, it just has that dumb vibe. Yeah. That's exactly what it means. Cool. So actually, that was actually quite easy <laughs> to get. Well done, <laughs> Cool. Uh, okay, this one I think I know as well. Uh, it's actually tackies, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Or was it techies? Techies. Techies, techies. So yeah, anyways. Um, I never knew what this was until obviously I, I was like, what is that? Basically, techies is uh, trainers. Yes. If you're in London, crepes. Not the French one. Uh, you eat, but just like, you know. Yeah, trainers, Jordan, sneakers, sneakers, whatever. Yeah. All that stuff. So they're, they're called Running shoes, whatever. Techies and essay. Yeah. So, so the slang word for that is techies. So yeah, so if someone says to you, oh, well, I like your techies. Yeah. So I like your crepes. Yes. <laughs> Cool. Um, <laughs> I, I knew this one was going to throw here because I've no, never used this one. This is weird. <laughs> so basically, this one is China, but I have a feeling like it's not said as China. It's spelled like China, but it's not China. It is. It, it is said like China. So you pronounce it China. China. Okay. Can you put it in a sentence, please? Um, we're going. How do I put this in a sentence? Uh, I really like the bride that you're making, my China. Is it like baby or my baby? Mm, close. I don't know, I think it's like a endearment or something. Like, a, it is. It's, it can either be like, oh, my friend. How about that? Yeah, that's correct. Pretty much. Yeah, so in. That's what it was. <laughs> yeah, so, so like, comes from the word, um, so it come, this one comes from the rhyming slang, the Cockney rhyming slang. Okay. Um, China plate is me. China plate is me. <laughs> <laughs> if you know anything about Cockney rhyming slang, that's where it derives from. Obviously, South Africa being a former British colony, um, that's where China comes from. Sweet. Uh, and the last one, uh, this one is Askies. This one sounds like an Afrikaans one. <laughs> That's pronounced Askies. Askies. Uh, do you want to use it in a sentence? Askies. I've never heard it actually. So I might be like... Um, Askies. I might burp and then be like Askies. Oh, okay, cool. <laughs> and that, that's quite easy actually. <laughs> Excuse me. Yes. Askies. Yes, I got it. Whoa, whoa. Okay, so I've literally got, let's have a look. So I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I've got seven out of ten. So that's actually 70%. That's quite decent. Yeah. So whoop, whoop. I. Kind of. There whoop. was a lot that you needed help on. Wow. China. Yeah, but the, the aim was. You didn't aim. know that one. Ooh, I thought the China was the country. <laughs> Alright, cool. Anyway, so anyways guys, uh, comment, like, share, subscribe, all that stuff. Yes. Um, and uh, yeah, we might even do a Somali one, which I yeah. need Somali. So yeah. Yeah, um, we'll do the same. So if you guys want to see that, be sure to comment down below. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, as has to be said. And we will see you in our next video. Peace. Take care. Bye. <laughs>